Welcome to our second in the GemLab video series. A green stone has come into the lab purchased as an emerald. First step is to check the refractive index. Table down the RR is 1.725 which is not emerald which would have been around 1.57 to 1.58. 1.725 is an indication of synthetic spinel. As I turn the Polaroid I still get one reading which suggests that the stone is singly refractive. Under the microscope we can see some bubbles along a flat plane as we focus into the stone which suggests a composite stone. The RR taken from the pavilion is also 1.725. Under short wave ultraviolet we get a chalky blue and green fluorescence which is characteristic of synthetic spinel. To illustrate it further, I'm going to place the stone in methylene iodide, which is like putting an ice block into water. You can see into the stone a lot clearer due to the liquid having the same or similar refractive index. There you can see the center piece is a slither of some green material. Out of the liquid, this gives the illusion that the whole stone is green. With an RI of 1.725 for the top and bottom parts, singly refractive, and the way the stone fluoresces under shortwave ultraviolet, we can conclude that this stone is a composite stone, with the top and bottom parts being synthetic spinel. Thank you for joining us. Be careful out there and remember to be sure of your gemstones, and don't take anything for granted.